Hey there, Nick Tooth is here. In this video, we're going to go over how to configure the Tmux Yang plugin to not scroll to the bottom of your buffer by default after you select and copy text with your mouse. So check it out. If I start a Tmux server here and, you know, let's say I run the lsla command 10 times. By the way, this repeat command is available in Zshell. So if you're running bash by default, that's not going to work. But in any case, it's going to create a whole bunch of different output here. Now, let's say that I wanted to, I don't know, copy these uh, three lines of text here. Now, I'm using my mouse here. And now as soon as I let go of the last left mouse button, boom, it's going to scroll me all the way down to the bottom of the buffer. And this could be especially annoying at times when I'm recording videos where, you know, maybe I'm selecting some text here and I let go and I copy it, but I actually want to talk about what was just selected. But now I have to go all the way back up here, find that spot and do that, etc. You know, I just find that uh, it's a little bit nicer to control that behavior of when I get scrolled back down to the bottom. And it turns out that actually the Tmux Yang plugin allows you to configure that. So here's my .files repo. It's available on GitHub. I'll leave a link to that one in the description here. But if you take a look here at my Tmux config, uh, I actually commented this out temporarily just to show on video here. But yeah, if you set this yank action to be copy pipe, then it is not going to scroll you to the bottom by default. And by default, if you don't set this option, it is set to copy dash pipe dash cancel. And that's in the documentation for Tmux Yank. So let me go ahead and just copy this here. I'll kill this Tmux session here. If you know, I'll just be uh, super safe here. I'll do a kill server. Uh, I think it's already killed anyways, but yeah, okay, cool. So now if we restart Tmux here, I do the same uh, repeat command that I did before here. And now we're gonna scroll up to, you know, to some point here. You know, let's say I'm gonna copy some of this text here. So yeah, we have, let's say, what is that? Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven lines copied here to my clipboard. So as soon as I release the left mouse button now, notice that it did that, but it didn't scroll me to the bottom, which is nice. And we can actually verify things. We're still copied to the buffer here uh, or my clipboard because yeah, I just pasted it in here. So uh, that is pretty cool. Very easy. Just one little command uh, that you need to set in your Tmux config. Make sure you stop your Tmux server, start it up again, and you are good to go. So I'm very happy that this exists. And I should mention here too, you know, if we go back to repeater here, you know, let's say that, uh, you know, you do select some of your text here, and now you do actually want to jump to the bottom with your keyboard. You can just hit something like the Q key, and that's going to jump you to the bottom there and not input any text, and you are good to go. But yeah, that's going to do it for this video. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments below. I'll do my best to answer all of them. Thanks a lot for watching, and uh, I'll see you in the next video.